All right, today I want to go over basically the fundamentals of lifting. And I know this may seem basic, but it's something that so many people miss. And it's not just about lifting heavy things and putting them down, right? There's a lot more to it. And focusing on your form, focusing on every single thing you're doing during a repetition is going to get you that much more gain. So let's begin. First off, whenever you're doing an exercise, you want to make sure that your stance is good. You, they call it like the athletic stance. Your knees are slightly bent. Your feet are slightly wider than shoulder width apart, and your toes are pointed slightly at an outward angle. So anytime you're standing and doing anything, whether it's bicep curls, overhead presses, you want to take that stance. Now, the next thing, when I begin to do an exercise, I don't just want to lift the weight and drop the weight because that's not doing anything. First off, think about what muscle am I working out? Okay, so with the bicep curl, I'm working out the bicep, obviously. Now, I wanna make sure that my elbow is tucked, so I wanna make sure my form is good, right? And then I'm going to slowly lift the concentric phase, and I'm going to slowly lower the eccentric phase. And the eccentric phase is even more important than the raising part because you're controlling the movement downward, you're really stretching those muscles, as you control the weight to its return position. And that is one huge key you don't wanna miss is you always wanna make sure you're going slow on the eccentric. So again, nice and slow up, nice and slow down. If you have to count in your head, whatever you have to do to make sure that you're doing that, do it. Okay, so your speed is good, your stance is good, now what? Now is your form good? You know, I mentioned my elbow being tucked. If my elbow's flared way out here. If I'm moving my whole shoulder, guess what? I'm not concentrating on the bicep muscle anymore. And this goes across the board for any exercise. Think about the muscle. Make that mind-muscle connection. Feel the muscle being worked. You should feel it stretching. You should notice what's going on in that muscle. So many times we just fail to think about what we're doing. We go through the motions and we just try to get it done and we're not really concentrating. So make that mind-muscle connection. Think about the muscle. Another thing is the squeeze. And I know I've mentioned this before, but basically what this is, is when I get to my peak contraction right here, I'm squeezing and holding just for a couple of seconds. And I can feel the blood pumping to that muscle. Then I slowly lower back down the eccentric face. That, so I've got my stance, I've got my nice slow movement, my form is good, squeeze and hold, then slowly lower back down. And I'm making that mind muscle connection in the process. Tying all these things together is crucial for your success in any fitness goal. What, what primarily, obviously we're talking about strength training here, but you've got to pay attention to these things. It's so important. Not only does it prevent injury, it's going to help you get better gains, help you get stronger. All right, I hope this has helped. If so, please hit that subscribe button. Let me know what you think in the comments. And remember above all else, you've got this.